backlog of immigration? Work permits, citizenship, what's the backlog about Okay. It? We have work permits. I think we're doing a good job. And if anyone listening to this show is having difficulty, please contact me. So during the House of Assembly last week, which was what, the well, last Wednesday, I took the, during the luncheon break, I approved applications that were made on the 8th through the 12th of April. That meant those persons physically applied for work permits during that time. So from all indications, the backlog on work permits is down to under three weeks, if all your documents are in order. So we shouldn't have any backlogs of Persons listening to the show have a backlog, please contact me. Let, let me ask you this. Talk about applying for a work permit. You allowed to do that in country? Yes. Meaning you should have been here, you could have been here already you working. You could have been here. You already. want an extension? Well, is that, that extension is a different issue. So a, a large percentage of the work permits are renewals. So those right. are persons who are already here. Who are already here. So we give, I think, in the last six months, 10,000 odd work permits of which six odd thousand, seven thousand were renewal and three thousand were new. They, the majority of them were for what? Those work permits? It's bottom ended. Uh, so the bottom end will be gardeners, live-in maids, um, household staff, etc., etc. And of and course... That's the large, largest percentage. And of course the people applying for these work permits are Bahamians. Yes. On the whole, well, on the whole, let's say for instance your expat community Yes. Uh, they will bring in their, their caregiver or their uh, personal assistant, yes. Um, but the majority of work permits, certainly in the gardener's section, are, are, are Bahamians. 